My name's Eben, your oil and lube specialist. If you're new to the channel, definitely subscribe. Not only do we use oil, not only do we use lube as in transmission fluid, gear oil, coolant, brake fluid, power steering fluid, hydraulic fluid, and well, multi-purpose grease. It's so important. That's what you'll see right here. Today's exciting. We finally got the dashboard in this old 1979 Chevrolet C20 pickup truck ready to go. We're gonna go test drive her now and we're gonna be showing you every fluid we change on this thing to get it to run better than brand new. That's the objective. Well, let's go ahead and start this sucker up. This thing's been sitting for like five years. All right. She sounds okay. She sounds okay, but we're gonna do a whole lot better. Our first drive. See how she runs. She's clumpy and lumpy and doesn't sound like she's spitting. She's definitely gagging a little bit. <laughs> she's choking on something. I don't know what the hell it is, whether it's carbon or what, but definitely it's definitely a little rough there is a little bit of a slipping there uh, when it shifted into third it had a delay it's not good <laughs> definitely some slippage Right, we're getting towed. Turns out the carb had all that crap in the tank. Got clogged right up. <laughs> Choked the sucker out. And our good man Gabriel here that saved the day he picked this up when the truck choked out. We're giving him the injector clean plus cetane boost. This cleans the valves and injectors. That's yours. That's going to go right in the diesel right now. And this is going to get a much cleaner burn, better fuel mileage, lubricates the upper rings. So it runs a lot smoother, less friction on the rings. And it, and it also lubricates the injectors, lubricates the fuel pump. Yep, you can just shove it in. That's it. It's that easy. And this goes in every single full tank as a maintainer. And you can also run it as a heavy cleanup dose, which we're doing now. He's only got about 10 gallons in here. So this is really going to clean it out. Also increases cetane. If you didn't know, cetane is actually a, a minimum of 42, but the all the dyno tests, when they test these engines, when they're brand new, it's at 45 to 46 rating. So when you're three to four points low on cetane, you don't have as much combustibility, you lose fuel mileage, you lose power to the wheels. So he's gonna feel that power difference and we'll do a follow-up uh, and probably do an oil change. So we'll, yeah. Sounds great. Perfect. Good to go.